What is up, guys? This is Kyle with Dirtbike Channel. Yes, you are watching Dirtbike Channel. Uh, you probably already knew that because <laughs> you might have already subscribed. If you're not subscribed, you should do that. Uh, if you haven't uh, looked at us on Facebook and Instagram, you should do that too because a lot of times you can keep in touch with what's going on um, a little bit faster that way. This is a ride. Uh, this was the last time I rode. Uh, this was just a couple hours before I tore my ACL on this home wrecker of a trials bike here. <laughs> Um, and this was a ride that we were doing, um, really fun ride where we did, we took the enduro bikes up and down these really, really cool trails and then we did them uh, back to back here on the trials bikes to kind of see what, what was what. And it was really fun to kind of see the, the nuances and you're trying to get up over rocks and I can tell you, I like that one right there and this one right here to get slam the front tire and then get up over that. And I had to stab a foot down but I did make it clean. I'll turn around and watch Tyler get up this thing. Let's take a look. You know, more than anything, what I was looking to gain out of getting a trials bike is just some slow speed uh, balance um, practice and, and there there is such it's such a different thing and obviously we're riding these trials bikes up this trail so there's there's competitive trials and then there's trail riding with trials bikes I'm not really interested in becoming a competitive a competitive uh, trials rider but it's just fun to have the different bikes and then and you know take them and, and learn learn some different things with the different bikes and it is really really interesting because some things are easier to do on a trials bike some things are easier to easier to do on a dirt bike because it's different disciplines, different skill sets that you're trying to employ, right? And uh, it'll be interesting to, uh, to do a little bit more of this um, here in the future and next summer as I get uh, as I get back on the bike. I'm just about ready. I'm about two weeks or so away from being able to get back on the bikes after my ACL reconstruction. And uh, But I just wanted to bring you guys uh, this footage. Okay, on this test, we're going down this canyon and we're seeing how many times we have to put our stab a foot down. Did it already on the dirt bike, so I kind of have a baseline of... Oh, shoot, I touched once.
not counting that one because the bike doesn't fit through it. I did the same amount of touching in about the same places.